This film is about the architectural influence of the Westmoreland County Courthouse. This magnificent structure, described as one of the region's most beautiful Beau Arts buildings, is located on Main Street in downtown Greensburg, PA. Erected in 1906, this four-story imposing architecture can be seen from several approaches into the county seat. Its central dome, 175 feet above the ground, is of Italian Renaissance style, one of only two in the world designed by the courthouse's original architect, William Cockrell. The exterior walls are faced with light gray granite from Maine. The massive central dome is flanked on either side by two smaller ones above the main entrance, originally covered with ornamental gold and ivory terracotta. The roof edges and pediments are decorated with stone banisters and ornamental carvings and figures. The tympanum of the front pediment is marked by sculpture in the granite representing art and industry under the protection of the shield of the nation. As a crown are three female figures which can be seen from the main thoroughfare facing east. They are symbolic of justice, the law, and the people. On the facing of the two large cartouches between the main entrance arches are carved with the seals of the county and commonwealth. The inside focal point of interest is the 85-foot cupola, or dome ceiling, of Romanesque design. The rotunda in the center extends up through four floors, reflecting light from four large semicircular windows at the base of the dome. The dome ceiling is painted with delicate floral arabesques and gold leaf technique. Circular mezzanines on each floor of the rotunda are balustraded in white marble. English veined Italian marble decorates the public hall walls as well as the rotunda. Corridor floors and ceilings are laid with bare colored mosaics. Panels are set with marble mosaics in Renaissance patterns. The grand staircase of marble from the first floor opens upward to two spirals to the second floor. Two original courtrooms on the second and fourth floors are enhanced by deep coved ceilings, colorful murals, and Edwardian globular chandeliers. St. Iago and San Domingo Mahogany complete the first and second stories, while quartered oak enhances the remainder of the building. French artist Maurice Ingres was commissioned in the early 1900s to paint 15 wall and ceiling murals. Oil paintings by the artist also include eight presiding judges who were on the bench from incorporation to the time of the 1908 building dedication and other founding fathers of the country. These portraits appear on courtroom friezes within decorative plaster laurel wreaths that favor classical French style, touches with gold leaf technique. 